Now, Deep Thought was the supercomputer programmed to solve the ultimate question of life, the universe and everything in The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. But now physicists at the University of Sussex say such a computer may soon be a practical reality. They've drawn up a blueprint for a quantum computer, which they say would allow fantastically quick processing to provide rapid answers to problems that would take current computers billions of years to solve. It's not going to be a laptop, though. We're talking about a machine which could be as large as a football pitch. But it could pave the way to life-saving medicines, truly accurate weather forecasts and unbreakable encryption. How would it actually work? Well, Chrissy Reedy has been trying to find out for tonight's special report. The answer to the great question yes. of life, the universe and everything yes. is yes. 42. Is fiction about to become reality? Like in the cult 80s comedy series where a computer called Deep Thought was able to demystify some of the most complicated questions of the universe. Scientists here at the University of Sussex have created the nuts and bolts of a large-scale plan for a quantum computer. They say it could potentially find a cure for diseases to predicting the stock markets. So this is the smallest quantum computer you could possibly imagine. There's only two quantum bits in this, in this quantum computer, what do you see here, and you can see how big this is. Now we've developed a blueprint where we could have billions of quantum bits and all of these would then do computations and would enable phenomenal large processing speeds. It's been an international collaboration where scientists have spent years refining theories. What scientists are doing here at the University of Sussex is encoding information into individual atoms like these two here. And that's what's enabling them to build a super fast computer. Capable of calculating complicated equations that conventional computers might take billions of years to answer. It's been a dream of, of myself and, and many scientists to to actually realize a quantum computer and, and many people even thought that it's impossible that you can't do it and, and, and we went, went to work and we, we came up with a solution. And scientists here hope to build a prototype in two years time. So we've thought about what components you would have to add, you have, we thought about what kind of power consumption the thing would have, how big will it be, how much will it cost. The possibilities for this groundbreaking technology could be endless. A supercomputer that could revolutionise our world. Chrissy Reedy, BBC Southeast Today at the University of Sussex.